Zero FXB ICOM 9700. Let's add my hotspot. So the first thing is come out of DR mode. Press and hold DR. And that's normal mode there. Now press menu and look for number two and tap DV DD memory there. Go down one to repeat a list. Select that. Now you could put, you know, you could put your hotspot into one of these. You could do UK, but I'm going to choose a completely new group. So I'm going to go down until I see an empty one. And there you are, 23 is unused. So I'm going to hold it down and go edit. And I'm going to call it my, it's just easier to find it, hotspots. That'll do, enter. And I'll probably put my open spot in there as well. And I've got a, a DV mega one as well. Anyway, so now, press, tap it. And then press and hold, see there's nothing in it because it's blank, yeah? Press and hold, add, and we can start adding now. Leave that alone, DV repeater, go down one, name. And I always call my main hotspot, I always call it just hotspot. Like so, it's actually a nice big keyboard, but anyway. And then enter, so that's just the name, which doesn't really matter. Um, home enter call sign does matter so press and then we're going to go m zero f x b and then keep going space 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 and then you want b enter and it should automatically put the next one in for us so go down to the next one yes it has it's in the group called my hotspot use from i always put yes on that frequency and it has to match the frequency on your hotspot so mine's 433.550. Keep going with the zeros. And then enter. That's the hotspot. Now, even though we don't, uh, we're not gonna, we're not using a repeater where you normally have plus or minus shift, you do have to still keep a shift in, yeah? So it doesn't matter if it's plus or minus, because the whole system's set up around repeaters. So now we're gonna go offset frequency and we're just gonna zero it, but it's still a, it's still classed as a as an offset. Position, um, that's fine, I'll just go none for now. And the time, I don't know, just leave it as that. Add right, that's it, and back out. So we've got that in there now. And to select our hotspot, and hopefully we'll get some activity. Now we're also gonna need to put our call sign in, otherwise nothing's gonna work, but we'll do that after. Of course you can use software to do this. This is the manual way of doing it. So go back into DR mode, press and hold. We're in DR mode and now we want to find, hit the bottom bit and we're looking for a repeater list and we're looking for my hotspots. There you are. And there's only one in there and we're in there. And at the top, um, let's just leave that a CQ a minute. Let's go to menu set and we're going to go down to, we're looking for a call signs here. Let's find it. My station, up and down, my station, tap. And there it is there, tap that, and it's in there. But if you want to add yours, just press and hold, edit, and go, you can put the first characters in, and then go space, space, and after, when you're after the line, put in, I've put in 9700, you could put John in there. And that's it. So we've got our hotspot in there now. So let's see if we can get it to connect to something. So we're going to tap the top one. Remember, it says CQ, CQ, tap. Uh, then we're going to go to reflector. Now, a lot of these are already in there, and we're going to go to link to reflector. We're not going to go use yet. Link, direct input, and then we're going to put 30 here. Actually, let's do 01 that everyone uses. <laughs> uh, and you can use XLX and change that letter to a C. You can use XLX, XRF. There's a lot more you can do here. Reflector 001 Charlie, which we've all heard of. So now we want it to link. So we just key the mic as normal. And it should talk to us and say it's linked or linking. I can see myself showing up in my hotspot. But um, some, if someone's talking, it won't link in. Or sometimes you've just got to be patient with it. And it will link in after a, a few seconds or maybe even a minute or so. Let's keep trying. F zero, zero, one. Charlie. There you are. Now, it, it took me... I had to um, reboot the hotspot and then it linked in. 
Uh, but we're definitely there now. Now let's talk to someone. Now, if you're just saying it. R E F zero zero one Charlie. And just so you know, if you want to turn on transmitting your position, tap here and just turn to DPRS, okay? And you can have your manual, put your location in manually or turn on your GPS. So let's talk to someone. So we're going to change the word link, yeah? And to, use, we still tap reflector, but we change it to use reflector, but we could do an echo test, see what we sound like. Unlink, link to reflector and repeater information, if you press that, it'll, it'll tell you what you're linked to. If you just key up a minute. Normally it does, but it didn't then, did it? Right, anyway, let's go to reflector again. Repeat, uh, go up back to use reflector. You do need to do, be in that. So let's call through my hotspot. Well, you can't see it, but the cable doesn't reach, so you, I might show you it at the end. But anyway, let's call through. Mike Zero, Fox X-Ray, Bravo, M0, FXB, calling for a contact on Reflector 1, Charlie. Uh, George 7, Bravo, Tango, Papa. George 7, Bravo, Tango, Papa, M0, FXB, receiving you loud and clear. Back to you. Thank you for all your videos that you've done on YouTube. Jeez, some meeting, Pete. Oh, very nice to, to meet you. So, yeah, I just added my hotspot to my... I'm using an um, IC9700. And I just added my... Uh, it's, just, it's a DV Mega hotspot. It's got a nice colour screen. Uh, uh, where are you located? Back to you. So I'll just show you my hotspot. The River Humber. DV Mega uh, and my dashboard on my computer. There it is. Pi Star dashboard. Program the program so I can, uh, where, when it stops raining, go out and uh, move it into the icon 7100 in the car. But I've, I've managed to do it all now, so everything is done on the radio and I'm having to go through the dashboard. Over. Hello, Charlie. Yeah, Roger. Well, it's all working well. And uh, I've, you know, I, I've only got this 9700 today. I've got the 705, as you know. Um, and I was thinking of getting the 7300 Mark II. I've got the Mark I here. Then I said to myself, do you know what? Instead of messing around with the 7300, because I'm really happy with the one I've got, I'm going to go for the, because the 9700's come down in price. I thought I'm going to go for the 9700. I wanted one for about, all oh, a long, you know, several years. So yeah, enjoying it. Back to you. There you go. Thanks for watching my channel. I'm not sure somebody was keying up with you at the same time there. Uh, it was a Mike Zero station uh, jumping in between us. So are you going for the 7300 Mark II, you say? M0 FXB. No, I was thinking of it, but then I decided rather than spend the money on that, I would go for the 9700, and that's what I'm on now. Bye for now.